Okay, let's have a go at this one then. It's y equals e to the sine 2x. So do y dx then. e to the something differentiates to e to the something multiplied by the something differentiated. Sine 2x is itself a function of a function. So now we think about this in our mind's eye. Sine of something uh, differentiates to cos of something. Yeah, multiplied by the something differentiated. So we basically, that's the answer. We work right from the outside in. So let's just tidy it up. There's the differentiation there. So we've got 2 cos x, cos 2x, e to the sine 2x. There we go. All right, let's just run that through again so we're, ever, we're all happy, yeah? So e to the something, apply the function of the function rule. e to the something differentiates to e to the something multiplied by the something differentiated. The something differentiated, we need to differentiate sine 2x, yeah? If you look at sine 2x, differentiating that, you have to, it's a function of a function rule again, so you reapply it. So sine of something differentiates the cos of something multiplied by the something differentiated. So you can put that in here, that little sub-problem, and then it all pieces together like so. That's it. Okay? So you do them, you just work from the outside in until you get to the basically to the end of the matter. Right, that's 33 done then.